This video is going to be an in-depth walkthrough of one of the best real estate snapshots on Go High Lower right now. So my mission today is to actually show you the actual snapshot that get our client tons and tons of results such as this. And it's also a follow-up video of one of the most popular real estate snapshot video on Go High Lower right now. I'm going to link that up um, right about now. So my mission at the end of this video is to get one of you to actually build the whole snapshot by yourself without spending thousand and thousand dollars of buying other people's snapshot or even our very own snapshot. But I understand this whole mind map, the whole workflow on how buyer becomes seller and how seller become nurture. If you're just starting out, I've been there before, you probably don't have enough cash or resource or finance to actually purchase this, you know, this guru snapshot. So if you understand this workflow, you're gonna be able to build it on your own or if you're actually getting one of our snapshots this video is going to help you either way to actually understand the bigger picture it has basically a buyer campaign a seller campaign a database reactivation campaign so it's a simple workflow let's have a look at it so when the buyer come in and he has to come in through the survey form which you have in your funnel or a facebook lead form then it goes uh, into just listed and it and uh, your CRM it just notifies the client that you have a buyer lead then that lead basically goes into campaign mortgage partner campaign uh, basically in our workflow if you can see in the buyer workflow So in this workflow, buyer just listed service submission, you can see it adds to the workflow home buyer mortgage partner. You can also add another workflow in this case, which says investment campaign if you want. It depends upon your requirement and your niche that you want to add your buyer in which campaign. So you can edit it in this workflow step, buyer just listed service submission. The next step, if the buyer replies to your mortgage partner campaign, then he is ready or he is not ready. When the buyer is not ready, he goes into not ready yet dripping. So if you see the home buyer not ready yet dripping, so when the pipeline stage is changed to not ready endless loop, this workflow starts and it's being added to not ready yet dripping campaign, which is a 50 day campaign. Next we have our the seller workflow. So in the seller workflow, we have a Facebook ad lead form through which the seller leads are coming in. Now these leads, um, when they come in into your CRM, we have a system notification, internal notification that will notify the clients that we have a seller lead. And then that lead would be added to the home seller campaign SMS plus email. Then that campaign, uh, the lead would be sent to the power dial let's show you onto our crm so here you can see in the seller workflow in the facebook ad facebook lead notify client it's being added to two different workflows uh, to home seller nurture campaign sms and to home seller natural campaign email this one so it will uh, it will both add seller lead to both the email and the sms campaign then after adding them the internal notification would be sent to the client it would be sent to the client that new opportunity has arrived right now at this time its name is this email is this phone is this and address is this then this lead would be added to our power dial campaign Let's learn more about the power dial campaign. So in the power dial campaign, we go for the manual call to your customer and add them to the workflow. If they do not answer it, we answer them into the no pickup campaign. And if they answer it and reply, you're going to manually add those leads into your replied stage. So if that leads basically replies, you can add it back into your replied stage in your pipeline. And if it doesn't reply, you can add it into no pickup campaign. The lead will go into a high intensity 30 day nurture campaign. And will enter the 90 day nurture campaign until it replies or converts. So let me show you.
this campaign basically. So, so this is the high intensity nurture one campaign. It has this email and SMS templates. After 33 days, the lead will get entered into the Nurture 2 campaign. The Nurture 2 campaign is basically a 90 day campaign which consists of different SMS and emails as shown in the workflow. This is a 90 day plan in a medium intensity Nurture 2 campaign. So if anyone who have not known me yet, my name is Vico Kang from Vicolize Online Consultant. I run a small six-figure marketing agency that serves real estate agents in Australia and New Zealand to get more listing and be more profitable in their business. At the same time, you know, we also an official Go High Level partner. We have actually onboarded 200 plus agency owner onto the software at this time of recording. So if you haven't got an account yet, make sure that you actually click the link on the description to make sure that you are actually using our affiliate link to get an account to get that bonus extension when it comes to the free trial so you're going to get a 30-day free trial when you're actually using our affiliate link high level itself is originally offer a 14-day free trial but because we are an official partner with them you are actually getting the benefit of the 30-day extension when it comes to the free trial as well as qualify for our bonus gift and our snapshot if you want to know more detail about the bonus gift and the help and the support the snapshot that we actually offer for new user as you know aka new affiliate that join high level through us make sure that you also check the link in the description as well without further ado let's get on to the video now let's move on to if it converts then it's ready and when there is no answer from the seller lead then the appraisal is lost now let's look at this uh, stage when the appraisal is lost or is not interested in your campaign or is not replying to you and have vanished into the thin air so it enters the 180 day nurture, then the low intensity uh, campaign nurture 3, then the, and then the least intensity nurture 4 campaign. So these campaigns, you can see them. This is the appraisal loss campaign of 180 days. So you are going to manually drag your seller lead into the appraisal lost pipeline. And this is the 180 day nurture campaign. Appraisal loss campaign, sorry. And it gets added into the nurture 3 campaign. So after being getting getting added into the nurture 3 campaign, the, uh, the appraisal loss basically enters the campaign nurture 4. Then afterwards, if there is no reply, it still gets into the nurture 3, back to nurture 4, back to nurture 3, and back to nurture 4 until it unsubscribes or eventually convert hey guys if you enjoy watching the video make sure that you also checking out this content right there